guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another Inside the Dressing Room. I am right outside of Dress Barn, which I don't think I've actually ever been in because up until now I've kind of refused to go into any store where the name Barn is in the title. So um, we're gonna try some new stuff out today. the plus size model has a new dress collection with them and that was incentive enough for me to get over the name and come and check it out so I wanted to take you guys with me so we can see how things fit and what things look like and if it's worth the money and if it's any good okay guys so this is the first dress from Ashley Graham and I was only able to find it two here in the store but I think there's more um, I'm wearing a size 16 of straight sizes but they have I believe up to a 22 or 24 in plus um, it's got the mesh top and then or the fishnet top kind of over a black piece and then we have a little bit of embellishment right here and gold zipper down the back if you guys can see it and then um kind of a thick scuba so this is the 16 um it fits okay i think it's a little tight um i could probably use the 16 plus um but i'm wearing no shaper and i think it gives a kind of a good shape really exaggerates my hips though um yeah not bad the dress is $48, so not bad, Ashley Graham. I really do like the style, I just don't like it on me. Okay guys, so this next dress is actually much nicer, I think. Um, it's a fit and flare with kind of a floral print to it. It almost looks a little palm tree-ish here, but definitely floral. Um, got pockets, it's a good length. It's like right above the knee, which I like, because I feel like we're getting so many midi skirts. It's really cool to have like another shorter silhouette because it gets so hot in summer. Um, bodice is really great, defines the waist, love pockets. So this is a great one. This goes for $48, that's pretty, that's pretty bomb for the price. Um, super easy to dress up and dress down. I think if I were to dress it down, I'd put like my flats back on with it. Oops, grab them. Kind of something like that. And then like a little, maybe cropped denim jacket. That could be really cute for summer. So this is an over, I love this dress a lot more than the last one. And just so you know, I'm wearing a size 16 Missy or regular in all of these dresses. So every dress I'm trying on is a size 16. So this is it for the Ashley Graham dresses and I'm going to try on some other stuff that they have. Okay guys, so this is one from the in-house collection, um, the dress barn collection. And I really, really wanted to love this. Um, but it falls short in a couple of places. Um, the top fits really nicely. The skirt is not voluminous enough for me. So I feel like the balance isn't right. Like it's just kind of a body skimming dress and I really wanted more volume down here because then it would have been like almost like reminiscent of Kate Spade and that would have been really awesome. I actually have a Kate Spade dress similar to this, the navy and white um, wide stripe and this one just doesn't just doesn't do it for me. Um, the fabric is really light but maybe too light so I would say that if you are not such an exact, if you are a true size 16, which I am not, um, this would work really well for you if you have less on the bottom than I do because I typically take it 18 20. Sorry about that, my camera died, so now we are on the cell phone. So um, what I was saying is that I have a Kate Spade that's similar to this, but it is fuller in the skirt, and I think that is a little more flattering. Um, the fabric isn't light, which is very nice for the summer, because I think it will keep you cool and not have to worry about it too much. It's a great length. Um, I would have just liked a little more volume on the bottom. Um, for me, like I said, if you were a, tri a true size 16, this will look really great on you, because you won't have as much going on here as I do. So here's a look from the side. Definitely cute. Um, great conceptually, but just not great for me. Okay, this is the next dress. Still a size 16 and considerably different fit. Um, it's definitely not for me, but I tried it on because wedding season is coming and I wanted to see if this would be something that would be good as a wedding guest. I think if this kind of dress is your style, this is actually a really nice like a wedding guest dress. Um, and reminds me a lot of my friend Amanda Allison. She would love something like this, but I think on me it's just a little too cupcake, a little too cutesy, and I would want something a little more, I don't know, a little more attitude. Um, but it runs a little big, I would say. I've got lots of room in the, in the waist, which I think on the other ones. Um, it's really comfortable, actually. And the price on this one is 46 bucks. I think for 46 bucks, it's a really great deal. Um, just not 
for me. So I have one more left and then we will talk about everything else. Okay guys, this is the last dress and it is by a brand called Carmen Marcvalo. Um, they do have a higher end line and this line is called the Lux by Carmen, Carmen Marcvalo. And this is by far and away my favorite dress today. How beautiful is that? It's perfect for spring. Built to define the waist, a nice high conservative neck, especially great if you're wearing weddings. Um, Armhole's not too big. And then, of course, the big seller. Pockets. You guys know how I feel about pockets. Um, I love this. It's got this like striped floral pattern that just kind of pulls like a watercolor painting. Um, this is an exceptionally beautiful dress. A really, really beautiful dress. Um, a little bit more conservative than what I usually go for, but because the fit is so great, it makes it a winner. Um, the light fabric is fantastic. The pockets are great. It looks great with my flats even. I mean, this is an overall thumbs up. So now the question is, what do I buy? Um, do I buy this one, which is very beautiful, or do I support my girl and get this one, which I did really like. Ooh. Decisions, decisions. Well, I am going to get changed back into my clothes and then um, make a decision. Hey guys, I just left Dress Barn and I did, hang, it's hanging in the back. I did end up picking up the kind of watercolor bluish greenish dress. Um, I thought it was really pretty and the more I started it, the more I realized I'm probably gonna wear the heck out of it. So might as well pick it up. Um, so my overall thoughts on the collection, Ashley's collection, um, looks like there's only three dresses total maybe um but they do look nice i will say they um i feel like the prices are fair for what they are some of the zippers were like a little janky and kind of hard to use um but for 48 dollars, i think they're i mean i definitely think they're worth the price if you like the style um I like that they come from like an 8 all the way up to like a 24 or something. I'll link everything down below so you guys can like check the site yourselves and see if it's something that you guys want to buy. I am melting. I apologize. I am like, I just looked and I'm like, whoo, so sweaty. It is 90 degrees today. So, um, anyway, point being, I think her dresses are really great. Now, as far as dress barn as a whole, I still think they're catering to an older demographic. Is that okay? Of course it's okay, it's awesome. Your mom needs stuff to wear, your grandma needs stuff to wear, not everything is for young people. Um, that being said, I did find, and you guys saw a lot of the dresses that definitely worked for me. I'm, I'm in my early 30s and it's all stuff I would have worn minus the pink dress. Um, so I think that there's stuff that does cater to a younger woman, especially a younger professional woman because the cuts tend to be a, on the more conservative side. Um, the service was really great, the store was really great, the dresses were really nice, I like that they not only carried their in-house line, they also carried Calvin Klein, Carmen Mark Valvo, and I feel like I saw a couple of other ones in there that looked really nice. So overall, I thought the shopping experience was really good. Um, the dress I picked up was $60, and I was able to go on my phone and find a 20% off coupon. So on top of that, it came down to $48, and then um, plus tax was like 52 or something. So I thought that was a pretty good price for such a lovely dress. Um, if you do go to Dress Barn, don't forget to look on your phone. There is a 20% off coupon right now going through March 13th which I will link down below so if you guys do decide to go shopping um, that you guys can get a discount too. So I hope you enjoyed this inside the dressing room. I thought dress barn would be kind of something different to try out. If you have any stores that you'd like for me to check out, please leave them down below in the comments and I will be sure to do that. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye!